Hi, this is Karthik from Design School by WP Algorithm.com. In this video, I'll explain what Elementor Scroll Snap is all about. And this is a part of Elementor starting with Elementor 3.5 Pro. So watch what happens as I scroll through. Each of the sections snap according to my setting, focusing on the thing that I want my users to look at. So basically you're snapping as the user scrolls and that's the reason why it's called snap scroll and it's quite easy to configure and and this is how you enable it click on elementary settings click on experiments and make sure that this scroll snap is set to active by default it will be selected as default click on the drop down click on active and click on save changes at the bottom of the page once you do that clear your cache you're ready to go now Page transitions work sidewide and scroll snap you have to set it per page. So just click on edit with Elementor. Click on the settings cog at the bottom left corner and click on advanced tab of the post settings. Click on scroll snap and here's where you should set scroll snap per page or post in your Elementor interface. So you can turn this off or turn it on per page. And you can define snap position. Basically, you can say where the section should come into focus. If you select top, when the user scrolls, top of the section will be focused as he scrolls. And if you select center, center of the section, same thing with bottom. And this is totally responsive. So you can change it per device as per your liking. Scroll padding. If you have a sticky header, you can make sure that your sticky header is not covering your scroll snaps stop. You can either choose to show it normally like based on the user scrolling or you can force scroll snap. I'll select always so that scroll snap is always effectively applied. I'll click on update. Now I'll open the page in a new window or in a new browser where I'm not logged in. Watch what happens as I scroll through. You can see since I've selected bottom, each of the sections bottom is displayed. Right. Let's change snap position to top. I'll hit update. Let me reload the page. If you have caching plugin, clear the cache. Watch what happens as I gently scroll through the page. I think it's not properly applied. You can now see that as I scroll through, only the top of the section is applied, right? Or only the top of the section comes into focus. You can select scroll padding if your sticky header is covering your section. Else you can leave it at zero. If you don't have a sticky header, well, this is not a setting. You can definitely set it to zero. And basically that's it. You just can configure how your sections show up as the user scrolls based on Elementor Pro's scroll snap feature. It looks really simple, but it plays a great role in enhancing the user experience. And this is part of Elementor Pro. If you don't have Pro, link to that will be in the description. You can get it through my affiliate link and that will basically support me in making more of these kind of videos for free and that's it for now to learn more about elementor head over to elementor basics playlist and to learn more about wordpress check out wordpress tutorial for beginners i'll see you in the next one Bye bye